Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to NT Madness some NBA 2K16 my team group play continues in group A This is game two of three for the Yukon Huskies as well as game two of three for the Kentucky Wildcats And this team might be the most stacked team not just in the group But the tournament look at that starting five Devin Booker for three bang And he's probably the least intimidating player on the court right now for the Wildcats Anthony Davis and DeMarcus Cousins in the front court Rondo and John Wall in the backcourt. Who do you sag off of? Who do you give space to? You can't double team off of any of these guys. These guys see John Wall proving his worth right there. And that's just the starting five. You got guys like Carl Anthony Towns coming off the bench. Look at Boogie. Throw it down with two hands right there. Cliff Robinson is no match. That's a turnover right there off of Drummond. John Wall on the break. Dishing the ball. Anthony Davis throwing it down. This is a team led by Stax. One of the vets of the 2K community. One of the best in the 2K community. And right now he's showing his muscle with his big men Anthony Davis throws it down again another turnover by the Huskies on the break is wall Devin Booker dishing it eventually moving the ball to find Davis from mid got it Walker not able to put much of a contest on the 611 Anthony Davis as you guys see Rondo with the ball driving finding the open man as he always does it's Buggy who throws it down that Sacramento King connection also is a Kentucky Wildcat connections you guys see we're just stuck trying to find the open man and the open man is John Wall on the other end and this game has quickly gone out of hand time out UConn pretty much overdue timeout right there you guys see John Wall high stepping and out of timeout nothing good can happen Anthony Davis rips Rudy Gay and on the break is Wall and Wall in for the layup these Kentucky Wildcats beat the previous opponent by, what, 17 points in the first game of group play. So, Stax, like I said, he's one of the best in the 2K community. He did his thing against Nick the Bulls fan, and he's given us uh, the same and then some. Look at these post moves he's putting on us. I can't do anything to stop Anthony Davis and Boogie just throwing it down in front of our guys. You see Brandon Knight, bang, not gonna count, but Knight off the bench. Like I said, this bench unit is pretty fierce on these Wildcats. Brandon Knight, Carl Anthony Town. I said it before, who do you guard? Kid Gilchrist coming off the bench. I mean, you can sag off a of Kid Gilchrist, but, you know, eventually that ball is going to find the open man. As you guys see, I'm stuck in the post there with Andre Drummond. I didn't have my stick set to shooting. I was trying to take a hook shot, and I ended up throwing, I'm throwing a turnover right there. So this time we get the hook shot off over Devin Booker. It goes in for Andre Drummond. Of course, Andre Drummond, known for that post hook in the post. As you guys see, Rondo for three. Bang! It goes in eventually. Not much of a bang, more like a bounce, bounce, and boom. As you guys see, we're going to find Ray Allen. Allen and he jumps and Ray Allen's gonna get three free throws off of that one trying to stay in this game after it just ended up being an absolute blowout in the first quarter gotta make sure we don't get beat by 50 out here right we gotta play for some pride as unfortunately Richard Hamilton fouls the jump shooter right there we struggled at the free throw line though Okafer I think Okafer shot a little four at the free throw line in the first half including a miss right there Devin Booker moving the ball look at Davis hop stepping there's not much you can do about that. Just hope they miss. Thankfully, Boogie missed that one right there. Rudy Gay pushing the pace. Rudy Gay driving to the rim. Finds the open man. That's Shabazz Napier. Winner of the tournament for UConn a couple of years ago. He led the way. If you guys remember, he led that whole thing about how student athletes have to, you know, be provided more um, food and stuff like that. Food stamps, whatever it was. You guys see Anthony Davis with the steal. And Anthony Davis, the big man with guard-like ball handling ability. Throws it down. Of course, Anthony Davis used to be a point guard back in the day as you guys see Kemba misses the layup right there and the lead is 21 and a half it was 19 in the first quarter so we kind of stabilized things but stabilizing isn't really gonna do much now one thing about group play and why this game is still important for us to play out and play our best in is because in order to move on to the second round if there's a tiebreaker the tiebreaker if we have the same record as someone else is based off of um, point differential so we got to make sure we don't get blown out by 50 right here so it matters a lot that we continue to play hard in this one maybe make a comeback if we don't our point differential might be able to help us or never give up attitudes you guys see we find Andre Drummond in the post and he calls the timeout Rondo 
step back for three. He's got that to go. I was sagging off Rondo the whole game. I absolutely did not respect that three-pointer until he knocked that one down. And I was like, what is Rondo's three-pointer? As you guys see, John Wall, that's just a tough shot at the buzzer right there. That's the magic of having a guy like John Wall taking shots right there. As you guys see, Kemba Walker penetrating, find the open man. But I accidentally make a few many two passes, take a bad shot, but thankfully it still goes in right there with Rip Hamilton. As you guys see, Rudy Gay draws the double-team Kemba Walker, pump faking, driving, layup is no good, but we're eventually going to find the open man. Once again, passing the ball too much by accident and spamming that X button. Uh, we still get a decent shot off of Richard Hamilton, not able to get to go, unfortunately. That would have been a nice shot to half near the end of the third quarter. Kemba, bang! Kemba Walker from downtown. The lead still stabilized. If anything, going our way a little bit, down to 15, a chance to cut into it again. This possession, finding a wide open Richard Hamilton from mid, but Richard Hamilton struggling with the jump shot right now. Carl Anthony Towns off the bench, backing down post, spin, throwing it down. The bigs of Kentucky are just too much to handle. As you guys see right there, I tried to step back with Kemba, but um, like I mentioned before, I didn't have my shooting stick set, so I did nothing at the end of the third quarter right there. I think I got like three turnovers because of that. I mean, like, I, I was pretty upset about that. I really wanted to just like quit the game, and I would have just been pretty dumb because it's my fault to quit um to like reset the game that would not be possible you know it would have been nice to have it but it's my fault for not having it equipped and plus even if i did do that stacks is probably winning the rematch probably winning it by 20 so it's not really worth anything as you guys see devin booker driving to the rim definitely you know i want to think i'm a decent player at 2k we're about to go 0 through 2 in this tournament but you know i didn't expect to be guys like stacks in the tournament you know just it's definitely no way for me to try to disrespect one of the best in the 2k community and say you know i'm coming out and winning especially when he's got a team like this it's already bad enough. Man could probably beat me with Davidson, but here he is with Kentucky. So definitely good luck to my man Stax and the rest of the tournament, fellow Knicks fan, and um, hopefully he does well with this um Kentucky team. Hopefully we can say we got beat by the eventual champions, and we can say that we hung in with him after the first quarter. The lead stabilized at 19 after the first quarter. We did pretty decently to help out our point differential. So, we'll see how that's worked for the rest of the tournament. We got one more game in group play coming up. More than likely, we're getting eliminated from the tournament. But like I said in the um, first video, it's fun to be a part of it. Leave a like and if you guys enjoyed the game. Subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys next time.